Good afternoon my YouTube friends, it's Margaret here from Morgues and Garden in England and I'm hoping to be able to do this quick video before the, uh, the rains come the clouds gathering Anyway, so what I've done today I've been very neglectful of these phalaenopsis uh, some of them have got names, some of them haven't. So um, I actually watered and fed these indoors and then I brought them outdoors and um, it has rained again <clears throat> so you'll see some of them are still hydrated and some of them are doing quite well actually. You see how they've got rain down there so we have to a good blow down into that area to blow any residue out and um, which I've been doing these have come into the garage but I've just brought them out now that's a cymbidium down there <clears throat> some of them what I've done is um, just put polystyrene because what I'm trying to do these hang on that rod in the grow room and um, and of course I can't have anything too heavy so I've put some of the um, cork chips and some of them I've just put polystyrene and there we go you see some of these are doing quite well the roots are coming through not sure whether the light is any good here <clears throat> um, but can you see how the water's gathering in there Look. but I'll bring these into the garage again and give them another blow and they'll probably stay in the garage until uh, tomorrow now this one I haven't removed the sphagnum moss yet um, which I'm going to because of course um, I can't have this wet. I mean it's alright at the moment especially when it goes in the grow room but during our winter months I can't have this wet like this. And <clears throat> over here, <clears throat> let me see if I can bring it up so we can see it a little bit better. There we go. This is the LC Bermazor palm. And what I've been trying to do is to wipe down these areas with the toothbrush just to clear them. I've taken the toothbrush upstairs now, I thought I'd cleared most of the mess. <clears throat> You'll see this, don't you? This is sunburn. But as a plant itself, see how I can show you. Can you see? I've tried to take this sheath back here and I notice there we've got another eye and if I turn it round again, let's see if I can. There. So See all the roots. So this is doing very nicely. And I'll leave this here. I don't mind leaving this out overnight because we've got the canopy from the roof and uh, that will protect it. Likewise, we've got this big um, Lelia purpurata. There we go. What is Cattleya purpurata? And we've got a new growth there, can you see? And I did notice I've got a root coming through that. Got some nice growing tips. So I've um, rubbed the uh, rhizome here, can you see? With the toothbrush. <clears throat> and I've got nice green roots coming. Sorry. 
Can you see them down there? So, this might benefit actually from staying outside um, for 24 hours anyway. Um, because we've got good breeze here. We're not expecting frosts. And uh, <clears throat> I can always put a clip on here. Mind you, I don't think it's going to, to blow off. This LC Burman's lapel. Oh, I can't tell you how dark those skies are now. Let's just have a look if I can zoom in any. Ooh, look. Can you see? Ooh. <clears throat> now, we don't normally get our rains from that area. As you can see, <clears throat> we've got blue skies there. This is, let me show you. This is where we normally get our rains from, here. So, let's take you back out now. And then, we've got, those are sweet williams, which I'll pot up, well, put out in the garden. Primroses, primroses, wallflowers. But not today. Too exhausted today. Of course our Queen died yesterday. And it upset everybody. I mean we know she was elderly. I mean my mum died when she was 91 and a half. And although selfishly we think, you know, they're going to be with us forever. But they're not. So um, I didn't have a very good night. Never mind. So, um, I'll just pan over here. We've had plenty of rain. The garden is looking so much better. And perhaps tomorrow, when I'm feeling less tired, I'll be able to come out tomorrow and plant some of these plants up. So thank you for joining me. Take care. Have a good weekend. Bye bye now.